Magical Girl Mickey! Here he goes! Hey guys, it's Adam aka Swimming Bird, and welcome to Tomodachi Life. We are back on Delmino Island. A lot of you were missing this place, so here we are. Starting off with the news flash, pawn shop uniforms. I have no idea what those look like. I'm gonna have to remember a lot about this game. Look at Lemon Grab, he's looking great. He's got a bow tie, a sweet vest, kind of old-fashioned, but it looks nice. So here we are, guys, finally back, and I need to catch up with my Mies. A lot of them probably hate me, some of them really miss me, I'm sure, or at least I hope. And a few of them already want to make friends. Pooh, what's going on? Oh, he's having an argument. But it looks like Emma Watson and Donkey Kong are in love. I forgot about all these couples. Little Max dreaming. And Midna is sad. I think Pooh and Midna might be having a fight. Let's help them out. Let's do a good deed on our first day back on Delmino. Pooh, you're so cute. What's wrong? I'm in kind of a bad mood today. Aww, have some honey and, and take a nap or something. What's I had up? a fight with Midna. Aww. I'm so upset. All right, we gotta we gotta make him feel better. You guys should make up. Please help me calm down first. All right, he is so mad. Give him some food, maybe. What what could he eat? Bacon always makes me feel better. Until afterwards, then I feel worse <laughs> from all the grease. <laughs> Does that gonna help a little better? Aw, Pooh's got a rumbly in his tumbly. And he liked it, and he leveled up. That's gotta help, right? That's gotta make him a lot happier. What can we give Pooh? How about I, uh, <laughs> it's gonna give him a, let's give him some bubbles. Pooh seems like he would just really get into some bubbles and just follow them around <laughs> like a little puppy or a child or something. I had a fight with him. Aw, he's, he's still upset. That. Despite leveling up and getting bubbles? Please help oh, we gotta help him. Okay, let's go. He needs something more. His belly is far from full. How about we give him... There's that birthday cake. That was from... I think that was from my birthday. How about some apple pie? That'll fill you right up. Let's see. Who likes sweet things? There he goes. Alright, that really... Oh, that's one of his favorite foods now. It bumped a... Now. It bumped something off. Pancakes, soda, and apple pie. Sounds good to me. All right, they're going to go patch things up. Hopefully, we'll we'll start the day on a good note, and Midna and Pooh will be friends again, because they're two of the cutest villagers, and they should not fight. Pooh still has that Mr. Rogers sweater on. <laughs> I, I've forgotten so much, because I'm, it's been a few months since we played. I'm sorry about what happened. And I'm sorry about the break between Tomodachi Life, but uh, I'm going to try to do some of these <laughs> more often. I'm sorry, too. Yes. All right, they are friends again. That's going to be a big boost to Pooh's level here. He's going to get a bit of experience. He's doing that little shaky dance. All right. Went really well. He made up. Thanks for your help. Anytime, buddy. Let's just pick pick up this Pooh. Here. I want <laughs> he's going to give me something first. I want to pick Pooh up. Just because he's so adorable. Put him in my pocket. Oh, a slide puzzle. All right. Let's grab him. There we go. Pick that Pooh up. Throw him in the corner. All right. All right. <laughs> Sorry, Pooh, didn't mean to throw you. Let's see, what else is going on? A few people are having problems, including Garfield. And, uh, what is happening? The Creeper, Samus Aran, Cat Mario, and Pirate Dracula are having a very intense workout sesh in the middle of a ghostly graveyard. I gotta get in on this. What is happening, Dracula? <laughs> He put his pirate hat back on. Dracula, you're not supposed to be wearing that. It's been too long, swimming birds with the I do recognize do you, you buddy. Recognize me? I know it's been a while. We're still gonna send you to space, Dracula. Do not worry. <laughs> hey, you wanna hear my impression of Danny? Um, of course. Let's see. What? <laughs> what do y'all think? That was actually one of her catchphrases where she's like, eh, I think. That might be when she's upset or something. I don't remember. Again, it's been so long. Spot on, though. I, I should do this for a living. I think that was actually her voice. <laughs> and he leveled up. Nice. Let's uh, let's give Dracula some pocket money. Because, again, we need to send him to space. I'm going to give him $500 towards his space trip. Here you go, buddy. Dracula, you're going to get to the moon. He's going to the red planet, though. He wants to go to Mars. Because he thinks it's made out of blood. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Still almost $9,000. We're on our way, though. we got to send this guy to space. I've forgotten so much about this game. Hopefully you guys haven't. If this is your first episode, though, we've got a playlist full of stuff you can check out. KK Slider, he's got a strawberry hat, and he is just strumming, looking like he actually does in Animal Crossing. Mickey's hat. He's got a problem. Let's, let's uh, peek in. On the twisted dreams of Mickey Mouse. Here we go. 
Doesn't look like he's having a good dream. He's kind of squinching. <gasps> the dreaded grapefruit outbreak has finally reached the island. Not the grapefruits. Mickey, we need your help. Oh, Mickey. I have power of life breath. <gasps> Magical girl Mickey. Here he goes. <laughs> yeah. Mickey, <Knight> activated. <gasps> this is Kingdom Hearts? Remember kids, never talk to strangers. Talking dogs, or inanimate objects. What about Goofy? <laughs> Goofy's a talking dog. <laughs> he had a superhero dream. I think Freddy had one of those as well. Freddy Fazbear. And we got a Robo Hero suit. Thank you very much, Mickey. That was a sweet dream. I think that was Zelda as the little fairy, ironically. I'm sorry, Mickey. I got things I'm doing, man. We got other games we're playing. He is super hungry. All right. Let's give, uh, let's give Mickey... I don't want to give away my birthday cake. I think, uh... Mickey would probably like a little bit of cheesecake. Here you go. Cheesecake, because he's a mouse. They're perfect. Didn't even think about that. But there we are. Half a belly full. He loved it. That's his, uh, hopefully it's on his favorite foods now. He likes blue cheese as well. I kept giving him cheese. <laughs> Let's see what else is happening here. And, uh, yeah, there's a lot. I completely forgot about Flame Princess wearing that wig. Jake is dancing. Finn is just, like, laughing at Garfield. I don't know what the joke is. But he's having a good old time. Epona's running around. Freddy Fazbear is not home. Look at this. Emma Watson and Cat Mario on a very intense workout. Who needs help? Isabel? Let's help her out. She is so cute. I want Isabel and uh, Pooh to, to get together because both of them are cute as a button. It's been too long, Swinny Birds look alike. Do you even recognize They kind of look pretty similar, too. All right, what's up, Isabel? I'm hungry. Oh, okay. Everybody's hungry. They haven't eaten for two months, so it makes sense. Do we have something that uh, Isabel would like? Maybe a coconut or something? I'm, we don't want to give her chocolate. She's a she's a doggy. We don't want to give chocolate to dogs. How about a candy apple? Because she does like uh, she does like apples. I'm I'm sure because it could be her town fruit. How about that? You like it? All right. She really liked it. Cool. It's now one of her favorite foods. Awesome. Got, oh, she's giving me a gift. Okay. She's so nice. It's a kaleidoscope. Okay. All right. Well, let's uh, let's see what else is going on on the island. We have helped a few villagers reintroduced ourselves. I was hanging out with T-Rex or something. There's oh, let's do the me news. Okay, let's see what's happening in actual me news. Slenderman here. You're watching me. What's up, Slenderman? Yeah. In a change to my news weather, we have a space weather. Space weather. weather. Let's go to a cosmic weather. <laughs> Moths are can fly into space, I think. Hi. So let's see what the space weather is up to out there. How's Mars for drag? The wind will be clear, but we'll have windstorms on Saturn. Hmm. Jupiter will be cloudy, and Mars will start off with rain, clearing up by midday. Okay. The sun is expected to reach a high of 6,000 degrees. So, if you're on the sun tomorrow, wear sunblock. <laughs> we asked some islanders All right. Sun Sounds good for Dracula. I feel like I've seen this before. To take off. Was right? that really the end of the story? Yeah. Thanks for watching. <laughs> I wasn't expecting it either, but <laughs> Mars is rainy and it's very windy on Jupiter, I think is what she said. <laughs> What's going on? Ash, what are you looking for? You see a uh, Charizard down there or something? I don't know. He probably sees Mewtwo because Mewtwo's coming soon. Smash Brothers. What's happening at the amusement park? Tomodachi Quest. Let's let's do a quick Tomodachi Quest. All right. So we have Little Mac, Flame Princess, Pooh, and I think Shaq. All right. A fried egg appeared. <laughs> if this is your first episode, this is the weirdest episode ever, I'm sure. All right. The fried egg took some damage. Uh, we don't want to use Flame Princess's fire magic yet. So this is just a fried egg. I'm going to save her MP. So I think we have two warriors. Shaq is a, uh, a rogue, it looks like. And I think uh, Flame Princess is like a magician. So hopefully we're going to do well with this team. We don't have any healers, unfortunately. But we're going into the cave. <laughs> yeah, I used to keep thinking about someone never watching Tomodachi Life until now. When we're fighting roasted chestnuts in a pixelated arcade game. Oh wait, both of them are actually... Little Mac and Pooh are uh, mage or uh, clerics or whatever you want to call it, priests. So they probably do a good amount of healing here. All right, just gonna keep trying to do some physical attacks. Hopefully Shaq will uh, pick up the slack here in terms of damage. There he goes. All right, chestnuts roasting on an open fire. Took a little damage. I think he can probably heal himself. There he goes. All right. I think, we, I think we got this. I'm trying to save my a lot of my magic until we get to some of the tougher foes. You know, fried eggs, chestnuts, not the toughest thing in the world. 
not gonna use Shack special. We're just gonna fight normally. Oh no! Uh, Flame Princess. I keep wanting to say uh, Isabel because uh, <laughs> Flame Princess has that that sweet hairdo. She kind of looks a little bit like Isabel with that updo. Oh no, she missed. All right, Pooh, you better heal her. There we go. Whoever has the lowest HP gets healed. Shack, finish it off. Critical hit. Did we get it? Chestnuts. Man, these chestnuts are tough. These are tough nuts to crack. We're gonna heal one more. And then uh, I think we're almost to the boss here though. So we beat these chestnuts and maybe we'll get something special. Critical hit. Come on, there we go. They have been cracked. All right, where, which way are we gonna go? Left or right? I'm gonna try right. I'm right-handed and hopefully that will factor in. Not really. No, we went the wrong way. All right, now we gotta go back and hopefully we don't run into something. I think we're probably going to. Yeah, we get an extra encounter with a milkshake. All right, this time I'm gonna try to use some special attacks to hopefully do a little bit extra damage. There we go, Flame Princess using the fire magic to melt the shake. Very good. And then hopefully Shaq can pick up the, pick up some more slack here. It keeps rhyming on accident. Special attack! It worked! Oh no, why is the milkshake breathing fire? I don't know, that sounds like a horrible joke. We only took a little bit of damage, so maybe I'll save my magic for now. It is so close to dead, I hope. It took a giant fire spell. You'd think it would... <laughs> my milkshake, when I order it, play, if I ever get a milkshake, it melts, you know, by the time I have it at the table for five seconds. <laughs> so you'd think a fire spell would get it. What is that? The boss is something... I cannot tell what that is. It's bizarre. It's a bouquet. <laughs> the evil bouquet is attacking. I need to start healing as soon as they take damage or we're not gonna do this, but luckily you got plenty of fire magic left. Hopefully that'll work. Two healers and a special rogue. Let's see if Shaq can hit another special. Did you do it? Yes! There we go. All right. We're gonna take a lot of damage there. Oh, too much. Whoa! Yeah, that was a lot. Okay. Heal him up. Heal him up, little Mac. There we go. He's good. And then we got our fire magic. Can use a bunch of these. I think we got this as long as nobody horribly dies from a big bouquet attack. I'm just gonna keep trying to special attack the shack because it does so much damage even though it will miss. I think we got this almost. All right. Oh man, Little Mac needs a heal. Heal thyself, buddy. He's out of MP, so now Pooh is Pooh's got to be the resident healer. Hopefully this will work out. I think uh, there she is. Yes. Yeah, I just like she needs a bit of healing there. Special attack, Shack. We can beat this bouquet. This evil bouquet of flowers. Oh no! Lots of fire damage. This is not good. All right, just try to. He, he can't do anything but attack, little Mac. Just throw your staff down and start using your fists. We all know you got a KO punch hiding there somewhere. Man, Flame Princess is actually doing most of the damage. It seems like her and Shack really holding this team up. Sometimes you don't get a good combo of classes, but this time I think having two healers did help a bit. Oh, jeez. Some of these guys are going to be real low. <laughs> Alright, come on, little Mac. Hit him, hit him, hit him. Don't miss. He still does okay damage, just nowhere near as much as these guys do with their magic. That's it for her fire magic. Come on, Pooh, your last heal. He healed himself. <laughs> Pooh, you're so selfish. You're stealing everyone's honey. You're stealing rabbits, honey. And you're, uh, you're only healing yourself. Little Mac, he just barely survived with one HP. I really hope we can beat... Oh no, we don't have any magic left. This is probably our last turn before someone's gonna die. We just gotta go all out. Alright, Shaq. It's up to you. Dunk it, buddy. Dunk it! 100, almost 200. No! Little Max dead. Flame Princess, you should be able... He pretended to die. Flame Princess, you should be able to withstand these fire attacks pretty easily. I think we, we can still do this, guys. We just gotta hit as hard as possible. One more special attack may, might do it. Let's see. Come on, Shaq. Did it work? No. Oh no. Pooh. <laughs> Man, this is a really tough boss battle. I was not expecting a bouquet of flowers to be this tough, but you never know. Anything can be deadly when you're navigating an underground cave. Let's see. Two, almost 200 there. Jeez. If Shaq's gone, mm, Okay, I don't know if we're gonna <laughs> I don't know if we're gonna be able to win this. Shaq was my money my my damage maker there. He was dunking it. Every day, all night. Oh no, and they're missing. Okay. Shaq pretending to be dead. It's all down to Flame Princess. Can she do it? 
Or are we going to fail horribly? 32 damage. No, Flame Princess. And, oh, it missed. She gets one more hit here. One more hit. Come on, do enough. She's like the weakest at hitting because she's a mage and she can't use her magic. She's dead. <laughs> All right. <laughs> the party was defeated. Game over. All right. Well, we failed Tomonachi Quest, but that's okay. We had fun doing it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. Let's talk to one more person here before we end out the episode. Our return to Delmino. Who needs help? Little Mac? You just failed me, Little Mac. Emma Watson and Garfield. Let's help Garfield. <laughs> He's got a problem. I bet he is just very, very hungry. And uh, he had a rough time. I think the last episode, he was he got a uh, he got dumped by Marceline, if I remember correctly. And he had to go on a, a soul-searching vacation. Let's see. Like to see a funny face I've been working sure, on. I would love to. Lasagna is only his number three favorite food. Very strange. All right, here goes. <laughs> <laughs> he kind of looks like now? a Persian cat. Like his eyes are all wide, and uh, that was great, buddy. I knew you'd like it. <laughs> I'm gonna think of even more funny faces to show you. Oh, these guys know just how to cheer me up. All right, thank you guys for watching. Please leave a like if you enjoyed this. If you want to see more Tomodachi Life, definitely let me know in the comments. I know this is an older series, but a lot of you were saying you wanted to see more. So let me know if you want this to continue. If you want to see Ash, Epona, and Link. Do jazzercise. This is the place to go. Squeaking and twerking. See you guys next time for some more Tomodachi Life.